I think very important win for us. Uh, we had a lot of ups and downs in games and it's normal. The calendar of October is like that and we are in the middle of, of it and of course not possible to keep a level of the game the way we all coach is once, of course, but I can say that decisive third quarter was the key of the game where we really put a lot of defensive effort and then, of course, then confidence for offense is coming from good defense as well. So I think well, the game was still open in a half, half time, you know, but third quarter was really, really good performance of all of the guys. And I think in that time we we take full control of the game and then on the end, you know, we just finish the game. So congratulations to the players, great effort, but I say, you know, to be more competitive in the in the next games, you know, we need to be more consistent. Komentator Mas Rungtynes, trener Sirskira, kad Rungtynes buvo banguotas, buvo tu vadinamu kalnelių. Tačiau treneris galbėjo, kad tai yra normalu, tokiam jau tam tarp karaštį, kalbėjo apie spalio mėnesį, kur jo komandos už 10 rungtynių dabar į pusėjo tą tvarkaraštį, ir normalu. Taip pat treneris išskiria trečiąjį kelinį, įvartėjo jį kaip raktinį į tą pergalę ir atsakymą pabaigoje treneris pasveikino komandą su pergalė ir dar kartelį pasidžiūgėjo. Coach, everybody, before the game, everybody talks about Tomas Pavelka, how to stop him, It looks like your plan was good. Uh, I must say, you know, Pavelka is, you know, it's a unique, unique size in, in the league, and of course he is doing a great job in uh, in Chalet. and uh, of course that was one of the topics preparing this game, how to to play against him. But in general, I, I say, playing against Pavelka is a team game in defense and in offense. So I think that on the end of the day, we did a good job. Klausimas buvo apie Tomašą Pavelką, kurį reikėjo sustabdyti, ką treneris atsakė, kad Tomašas Pavelkas yra unikalus, unikalus dydžio žaidėjas visoje lygoje ir vienintelis būdas, kaip jį galima sustabdyti, tiek polime, tiek gynyboje, tai yra komandinis darbas. Ir treneris pasidžiūgė, kad tą pavyko padaryti. Coach, a lot of games at home and now three games in a row on the way. Uh, what, what, gonna, what, what will be most important in this game? Yeah, first of all, That's the schedule, but I say right now home court gives you some advantage, but in general not not that big advantage. You know, it's still still early part of the season and the teams are still not all in a full shape, which is normal, of course. For us it's good that we keep keep this home court advantage well, that we won these games. Of course now the games are way coming. We had this already two games away in a row, so we know how this experience looks like and we would like to just keep working on our level of the game that give us chance to be competitive. So we go next game, game by game, and then we will see. In general, we know what this week is waiting for us. We try to be ready for that, to respond well, and I hope that we'll have some success. Po daugelio namų rungtynių dabar atrinos komanda turės kelių išvykų maratoną. Klausimas buvo apie tai, kas, bū, kas bus svarbiausia tose išvykose, ką treneris atsakė, kad šioje sezono stadijoje namų pranašumas, namų sienos duoda pranašumą, tačiau ne tiek daug. Komandos dar yra įsibėgėjančios, ieškančios savo žaidimą. Treneris pasidžiūrė, kad pavyko išnaudoti tą namų pranašumą ir iškovoti tas pergalės, kurias pavyko iškovoti. Tačiau treneris atgripė dėmesį, kad kiekvienas atskiros rungtynės žiūri vieną po kitos, toks yra tvarkaraštis ir tiesiog reikia žaisti. It will be very short, so it's not acceptable how we play, it's not acceptable energy, and still we have a lot of turnovers, and actually uh, we need to go to practice, that's it. Uh, John Davis uh, scores only two points today, what happened to him today? He just played a bad game. And uh, when the brothers will come back? We don't know. <laughs>